You remember the new Super Mario Strikers game that came out? Mario Strikers Battle League? No. I figured I'd be making a lot of videos about this game, because I really do like Mario Strikers, but it disappointed me. I mean, it's not as disappointing as, like, the latest Call of Duty games. Like, the trail of tears wasn't as sad as the latest lineup of Call of Duty games. But it feels like Battle League was closer to Mario Strikers Charge instead of Super Mario Strikers. It was still kind of fun, but not as good. The online was as consistent as a high school dropout making a positive impact in the real world, so that's not so good. Maybe I'll figure out a plan for that, how to play it better. But I had realized that I never actually beat the final cup. There are several cups you can complete in this game, and when you beat them all, you get Galactic Mode. I still hadn't beat the Championship Cup on Galactic Mode. So I looked at my videos queued up, and it was empty. So I said, fuck it. Let's make a video of this journey. So it might be as shitty as a Steven Seagal movie, but like someone giving a contract to Steven for that movie, it's a chance I'm willing to take. I also got a bit of a runny nose right now, so it probably don't sound super good when commentating this. If you want to run away from this video, I will not blame you. I really don't. So let's begin. Uh, oh, I'm already in a tournament. I'm in the loser bracket, that's not so good. Yeah, it's like double elimination, so you, you can't lose twice. And I must have already lost once. Huh. Looks like I forgot how to play. I remember how to play. So I won. That's surprising. Like, the odds of a whore who's living under the underpass not having an STD was greater than me actually winning this game. That's more accurate. I didn't win this time. That's not so good. <laughs> this feels like a more official attempt. Like, I'm actually starting from the start. Unlike what my past self always does to me, I was in a crappy situation to start. Although, I still don't know the best tactics for this game. I kind of play it like I did back in the GameCube days. Or, or it's like hockey, if you actually know that sport. I get a lot of shots in net and try to forecheck off the goalie's pass, trying to either use hits or items. Keep it going, you eventually get a good shot and possibly a goal. Yeah, my strategy is all about... Which works, as I won 5-1. to one. Maybe it's because the team was full of shy guys. A bit of confidence could help these confirmed losers out. But one thing that got me is how it switches you to your other players. I don't know if it's something I control, because I really don't know the fucking controls, but I routinely had a player in good position on defense, and I wanted to use him to hit the opponent. And it would switch me to someone else. Like, this is absolutely terrible, and I've seen a Steven Seagal movie. I get it's probably hard to program this, but I feel like a two-year-old would do better at driving a car than they did at programming this fucking mechanic. Alright, next game. Maybe I shouldn't complain. What actually are the controls? Ah. The lot pass. I'll try that. I did not use that correctly. Fuck me. Fuck this. Fuck Call of Duty. Look, you gotta understand, I did fall behind, but when Steven Seagal is on your team, you always have a chance. Gotta say, going to Golden Goal, it's about as exciting as seeing titties for the first time. I ain't scoring off this hyper strike because I kind of fucked it up, but I'm gonna clear out the opponent's great position, and we got the- Did you just kick it into the fucking goalie? Whoa, Lee, are you trying to eat someone's ass to ensure that you were this shitty? But it's okay, though. We can give this guy a rose as he's got the perfect type of strike going on, and that is the GWG game winning goal. I now got two chances to win this cup. Uh, this is uh, faster than I expected to be in this good a position. Why the fuck is it the shy guys again? I mean, I know it could be them because it's double elimination, they probably lost once. But, like, how? Did they get confidence or something? Did they finally get a girl or something? Did they finally get a girl wet in their bed right after they cleaned their sheets, which is extremely disappointing, and redoing it was a complete waste of time and water? Well, I guess they are kicking my ass. Maybe my AI brain was the thing that was washed up and dumber than Call of Duty fans. Yeah, I said it. You can't really defend these games. Although, this is my new strategy. Screw getting great shots. Just get broken-ass hyper strikes. Nice work there, you anorexic fuck. Not much time left? Give him hell, you fat fuck. I do love how he makes the ball eat his ass. Like, you know the ball really doesn't want to eat his ass. But it's what gives me a 4-3 lead with 15 seconds to go. Oh, shy guy. Yeah, I know. They wet the bed. Either you clean it up or you sleep in it. 15 seconds from completing this. Okay, I got one item. Let's use it well. Let's use it now. God fucking damn it. Please save it. Thank you. Let's just hold the ball for the rest of the game. Gotta throw it eventually. Alright, just pass it the field. That's not it. That's not it. Oh, thank God. Don't... Okay. Okay. Whew. Whew. That was close. That was too fucking close. Whew. Well, I, I didn't actually expect to complete this on the second try without a, even a loss. But miracles do happen. Steven's goal was pictured standing up recently, so you know miracles happen. That's it, everyone. I've beaten all the cups in Mario Strikers Battle League on both modes. If there's another challenge in this Mario Strikers game, let me know and I'll likely fail at that. But for now, it's like 2 in the morning and I've got to work tomorrow, so I really gotta get some sleep.